Hello and welcome to another haul video. I just wanted to stop in today and share some of the newer things that I just picked up um, both well online and from my local scrapbooking store. I bought a lot of stuff recently um, and I kind of just stacked up I guess. I won't be buying anything else most likely until the end of the school year for me because I really really need to crack down and start studying a lot more. Um, just because a lot more midterms and finals are coming up. So this is kind of like my present to myself and it will all be waiting for me when I get done with class. So that's my justification. I do have a lot of stuff in this video. So first I wanted to share my lawn fawn order. And this is adorable. They always package them so nicely like this with a little thank you stamp. And this one says merci. It's one I don't have yet. And then a cute little note from Kelly Marie. And I've actually gotten a note from Mike before too when Kelly was at CHA last winter. Um, and then I got the Fly Free stamp, mini stamp set. I didn't have this one yet. Their little birthday um, stamp set that you got free with the $50 order. You can also buy this next month with their next release for probably about $4 since that's what this one costs. Um, and then I picked up their four new stamp sets. Um, this one is Critters in the Forest. This one's Plus One. This one's Say Cheese 2 and Say Cheese. And these are definitely some of the most awaited stamps Lawn Fawn has ever had. And I'm so excited to start playing with them. I just think all of these image are, images are super adorable. And this one, even though I... I'm at the age right now where none of my friends are really having babies, um, except, you know, a few scrapbooking friends are having some. Um, I can definitely see using this for a lot of different things other than babies. I mean, you can cut out these stars and moons, and you have the umbrella and the oven, just a whole bunch of really cool stuff. Plus, I love this font. And so I'm just really excited to use these stamp sets. And the next thing, while we're on stamps, I guess, I have an order from Paper Smooches. And I just ordered two sets from them because, well, I wanted to stay, keep from spending too much, but I know that I will definitely be ordering more from them in the future. And this is how they come wrapped. Actually, her business card was underneath here. And it comes wrapped with this cute twine. And then I got Vegtastic and Pretty Phrases. And I just love her style, and I'm really excited to see what she comes out with. I believe the re release is the first of each month. So that's coming up pretty soon. Um, another thing that I noticed that is really cool, she includes the copyright paper smooches pretty phrases as a stamp in the thing instead of just on the plastic just in case you decide to sell your cards then that applies to their angel policy as long as you stamp that on the back then you're good to, to go and that's really nice to have so what else did I get? I also got some an order from the twinery and this is my first order from them and I just love these colors. They come, these colors all come on big 240 yard spools, but those are about $14 and I wanted to try all of the colors out before I order spools. Um, so we'll see. They, these each have 15 yards and it only cost me about $20 to get the whole sampler and this is really high quality twine. So I'm really excited to use these more. And also, it comes with a little sample of some of the twine just with the business card, and I thought that was good. Next, I wanted to share with you what I got from my local scrapbooking store. It's called um, Anchor Paper Express, and it's on University Avenue in St. Paul, Minnesota. And I bought this, the Polka Dots Cuddle Bug Embossing Folder. It's the full 5x7, so that'll be really cool for covering the entire front of a card. And I just hadn't really seen that in person, so I decided to pick it up and support my local place. I also picked up these letters from Jelly Bean Soup. They're both on craft, and this one's brown and this one's black, and it just looks 
like it's I'm gonna get a lot of use out of this and they were only about three dollars each for 924 stickers so that's a pretty good deal next I also got some clear bags from them 100 clear bags that will hold an A2 size card and that'll be really great for gift giving and for just you know selling cards and things like that and I also picked up the salt air mini deck from Cosmo Cricut I just love these patterns and I don't buy well I try not to buy 12 by 12 paper unless it's in my studio calico kit so this was a good compromise for me because I love this and we almost bought the 12 by 12 papers and I also got some tags, manila tags just because I thought they were cute and you can buy them just individually and I also got this birthday Anya stamp that I showed in my video tutorial Monday um, posted yesterday and I'll link to that on the screen here but isn't she just adorable? She's the stamp of the month at Anchor Paper Express. Alright, and now I'm moving into Paper Tray Ink. I actually placed two orders from them, uh, the, both on the same day because I wanted to make sure that I bought the stuff that I needed to restock on before the release at night when I usually forget stuff. <laughs> and since both of my orders were over $50, they have free shipping on both, so that works. And yeah. So here are their paper coasters. They're a dollar for twenty-four, I believe. And I'm excited to use these to die cut. They're a really thin chipboard, but they're very sturdy. I got some half inch score tape. I have the one quarter inch and I love it. So I just figured I should add this to my collection and it'll be great for using with glitter and stuff like that. And then I I bought some my first impression plates from them. I got the wood grain, and then I also got the, I want to say it's Moroccan tile, but I just love this pattern, and I love seeing what people have done with it. Um, and the reason why I got these was I was on a retreat and got to use some of Nicole McGuirk's um, impression plates and just love them. So. Uh, be on the lookout for a tutorial involving those sometime soon. And then I also got the mats that go along with the impression plates. And then you just use these on top of the impression, on top of your paper, on top of the impression plate to get a full impression. So, like I said, be watching for a tutorial about that. But I'm really excited about those. Um, and then I also just picked up some extra cardstock that I'm running low on. Some Smoky Shadow, Enchanted Evening, and for and Spring Moss, all in 24 sheets because I use these colors a lot. And then here's my second order. This is just the stuff from the release. And you can see it's kind of a small order. Um, I got the Taggett's number two, which is really cute. I love that they coordinate with the fillable frame dies. And they have all these great sentiments and little cute stamps. I got the tiny tags. I'm so excited about this. They have the collection where each tag has like a polka dot pattern. And then they also have solid fillers. And then just a million sentiments. And the coordinating die, which I am in love with. It is so cute and I'm going to use it on everything. <laughs> I also got Stamping Simply by Maybells. This one is the Modern Basic Stamp Set. Um, I was on the fence about this one, but I really, really liked what the design team did with it. So I'm hoping I can kind of recreate some of those looks and um, create a lot of really cute, clean and simple cards. And I just love how the sentiments are included in the blocks here. And last but not least, I got the Gingham Basics. Um, and this is just a great background. It'll be great for baby cards and for guy cards especially. Stamp this in a navy and it'd be great. So, I think that is all that I've picked up recently. Um, which is a lot. Don't get me wrong. Um, and, yeah, so I'm looking forward to getting to use all of this. Hopefully I'll have a little bit of time to craft in between studying and everything else that I have to do for school. 
but thank you very much for watching and I hope you enjoyed kind of shopping along with me. And I will catch you again another time on my next video. Thank you very much for watching.